This is the home of the fast pace WWE news, rumors, headlines in your face because I am the face that books this damn place with the latest backstage rumors, news, headlines, and gossip. Already talking about Roman Reigns, SummerSlam, and the WWE Universal title. Now, there's a lot up in the air. There's a lot of plans that are still being misconstrued, talked about, and laid out and planned out on the table concerning Goldberg, the Universal title, and Brock Lesnar. Now, if Goldberg does indeed defeat Kevin Owens, which there are other plans for Kevin Owens to actually beat Goldberg with an interference from Brock Lesnar. There's a few different versions of the rumors and news coming out right now. But here's another rumor to the situation for the Universal title. If Goldberg does in fact defeat Kevin Owens at Fastlane, another plan on the table being rumored is that Goldberg will win the match and then Goldberg will face Brock Lesnar and then Brock Lesnar will become the Universal Champion to get his win back, to finally get a comeback. And then Roman Reigns will finally have that huge monumental rematch against the Beast Incarnate Brock Lesnar because by that time when SummerSlam comes around, the WWE will have it written in stone that Roman Reigns is not the one to frown upon because they're going to be grooming and gracing and building back up Roman Reigns to the Universal title, which is why they have it going against Braun Strowman, which is why Roman Reigns is going to take on The Undertaker because WWE has more plans to build up Roman Reigns. But here is the thing. Here's the specialty of this. Here is the orchestration of the plan unfolding. Rumors of Roman Reigns moving into SummerSlam. Now, I mean, this is months away. I mean, so this is a story I will follow. And if there's any developments or changes, I will bring it to you. I know it's, you know, very, you know, early in advance. I know they, you know, this far in advance, whatever you want to call it. But Roman Reigns, Brock Lesnar to battle for the WWE Universal Championship on the Raw brand. However, a monkey wrench could be thrown in those plans if Roman Reigns gets moved to SmackDown, but this match could still happen because there's rumors that'll be seen in Orton moving back to Raw while Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar move to SmackDown. Now, if you look up Brock Lesnar being drafted to SmackDown, you will see those rumors, headlines, and speculation online of Brock Lesnar going to SmackDown. You'll see the rumors about how, well, no, Vince McMahon actually said a guy like Roman Reigns going to SmackDown. So there's going to be huge adjustments, um, major shifts, major upgrades, Roman Reigns, Brock Lesnar in a WrestleMania rematch from a couple of years ago at SummerSlam 2017. Your comments, your opinions as I'm dealing with the damn flu, a cough, influenza, congestion, upset stomach, diarrhea, the whole damn thing. All right, I don't have gonorrhea. don't want to have that, but if anyone does, I feel bad and just get the proper treatment to help because I'm getting the proper treatment to help of my flu right now, even though my temperature is still skyrocketing. Your comments, your opinions, I work around the clock, even with the flu season. Sean Dream Entertainment is here to give you all the reasons to tune in and more, where I settle the score, because I'm the face that books the list. Do you want to see the rematch of rematches? Barack Lesnar versus Roman Reigns. And what was one of the most realistic WrestleMania matches, and most one of the most physical matches I have seen in quite some time. You can say what you want about Roman Reigns, you can say what you want about Brock Lesnar, but these two meshed well together, and they gave you a hell of a competitive and compelling match. Subscribe, smash the bell, don't go anywhere if you smell what I'm cooking.